Astronaut tried marijuana in space. Fake or real? Well, exploring space would definitely be a treacherous adventure. And when it comes to space travel, many things would definitely kill you. Still, that's no way enough to discount how fun a space adventure is. And just like this viral photo of a spaceman, who appears to be leveling up the fun by trying marijuana in space. But could we really smoke in space? You'll see that at the end of this video. So without more delays, let's begin. Okay, actually smoking weed is not really hard. You just need to put that marijuana into a smoking device. Then, you'll smoke up the fun. However, maybe this only looks simple because that's how it works here on Earth. So what if you plan to do that somewhere else, like outside the planet? Literally looking for an out-of-this-world adventure, right? And ultimately, what would happen if you daringly smoke weed in space? To get us a good insight about that, we got this viral photo of spacemen trying marijuana in space. Chris Hadfield is a retired fighter pilot and astronaut who made the journey into outer space and has spent more time exploring the universe than any one of us. His social media account, mainly known for its informative post and light-hearted banter with other spacemen like himself, and has more than 2 million followers, has been going viral for another reason. Since an image has been circulating that shows him holding what appears to be quite a large vacuum-sealed bag of marijuana while floating through the International Space Station, Sadly, despite what's on social media, smoking marijuana in space might be an extraordinary experience, but trying it aboard the ISS isn't that quite advisable. And forget even lighting up the joint since you might not actually even be able to get high outside of Earth, since there are cosmic rays that can affect your overall mood, appetite, energy level, and memory, just like marijuana. So smoking in space would only mess with the unique high experience associated with it. And so far, there hasn't been yet a single astronaut who has smoked weed in space. And there are several reasons for that. Mainly, it's more likely that something could go wrong when trying new things in space. And one careless mistake could be fatal and cost more than just your life and billions of dollars. However, the thought of smoking pot while observing the natural magnificence of the Earth in space, with the city lights glistening off the planet, might convince quite a lot of marijuana enthusiasts to hope that this could be personally experienced. And going back to the photo, sorry to disappoint the fans of both space travel and marijuana, that these photos of Chris Hadfield with weed in space was in fact doctored and obviously fake. Hence, the original image was posted for Easter that shows him holding a bag of pastel-colored eggs instead of cannabis buds, featuring the caption, Don't tell my crew, but it brought them Easter eggs. But to make things worse, we've got even a bigger concern with the attempt of being the first weed-smoking space explorer. And that's the oxygen-rich environments that we've got on every shuttles and space station. Also, Neil deGrasse Tyson, a well-known, credible space expert, physicist, and so on, mentioned that lighting up inside could create a spark, then a massive explosion. You have just discovered an amazing story about the viral photo of an astronaut trying marijuana in space. And now click this, and let's see the next amazing story.